Hi everybody and welcome to Football Friday Rewind. I'm Dave Walls. You know, one player can make a difference to what every coach will tell a young squad during summer training camp. And perhaps the best example came at Appomattox in 2015 with a team and a town rallying around the power of one. Here we go. Good, good. The 2015 Appomattox Raiders did not have a ton of hype. Coach Doug Smith's team went just 6-5 and five with a first-round exit a year prior with only one 10-win season since 1999. Their character is great. They give tons of effort. Well, I think it's natural for our young guys to uh, feel pressure as they grow and get more experience. I think the, their, their future looks really bright. But the mood in Appomattox was not one for cheering. Wipe all those teardrops from your eyes. In the months before the season, high-profile incidents ripped the community apart. Suicides, fatal accidents, and violent disputes cast a shadow over the town and the team. It definitely was a, a time that we could talk to the kids about life and, and, and let them, uh, you know, think for a moment, you know, how important life was. And, uh, you know, it, it also helped to motivate these kids because, you know, we would talk about the tragedies and, and we talk about, you know, playing for a purpose and having, you know, being excited about having another day of life. But the mood and the Raiders' fortunes started to look up with their new motto, the power of one. Everybody is a family. If one person messes up, we all mess up. And we're all just one as a team, as friends, as family. It means a lot. It means more to the community more than the football team. It's just saying that we're all one and we're all in it together. As the team continued to win, the town began to rally around them. 12 straight wins heading into a showdown against a Richlands team that averaged nearly 50 points a game coming in. The game looked lost, trailing by two touchdowns with six minutes left. But then... The Raiders made plays when they needed them. QB Matt Page to Buster Henderson tied it up with just over three minutes left, forcing overtime. Richlands looked set to win it in OT when future Liberty Flame Javon Scruggs jumped a pass near the end zone for a crucial interception, his second of the day saving the season. And Appomattox would not look back. Trey Walker plunging in for the game winner as the Raiders win it 27-21 in overtime. Two weeks later, over 5,000 Appomattox fans saw their Raiders win their first state title. I think the whole town of Appomattox was here supporting the Raiders. 2015 kicked off the first of three straight state titles, with Appomattox going an incredible 44-1 over that stretch, proving the power of one can make a difference on a team and in the community. PO1, number PO1, Appomattox Raiders. That's who we represent. One is a powerful number. Individually, we can only do so much, but together, if we work hard, they could accomplish a lot. For Football Friday Rewind, I'm Dave Walsh, ABC 13 Sports.